Hey, what's going on everyone? I am Sir James from GamerFusion.com and for this video, I'm going to be taking you on the holiday sale page that's going on over at GameStop. Now, these deals are from December 9th and will be ending on December 15th. So let's go ahead and take a look at the ad itself. So let's go ahead and start over here at this red tag. GameStop is offering double in-star credit when you traded any handheld systems towards a new Nintendo 3DS or 3DS XL. Pretty good deal right now, especially if you happen to have the old one like the DS or DS Lite and you really want to get the 3DS or 3DS XL. Pretty good deals right there. I've heard some people actually having some good trade-ins, but you could always check with your local GameStop on how much you're going to be getting for, you know, with the double in-star credit and things like that. So over here they have the 3DS. 3DS is going for the normal price for $170. But they do have a really cool bundle going, which is right over here on the right hand side for $200. So what this comes with is a limited edition Nintendo 3DS XO, which includes Mario Kart 7, which is pre-installed on there. What that means is that you're not getting a physical copy, but instead the game is fully installed on the 3DS XL itself. So for $200, for an extra large 3DS and Mario Kart 7, that's a sweet deal right there. I actually want to go for that one right there. So definitely go for that one if you're looking to get a 3DS for yourself or for someone else. Definitely get that bundle for $200. Like I said, these deals are from December 9th and will end on December 15th. Definitely go for that one if you really want a 3DS. And of course, I heard the 3DS XL's battery life is better than the current one. So just letting you guys know about that. Over here they have some games for $40, which is a normal price right now. Over here on the bottom portion they have some games for $10 off, so these are going for $20 each. So you got the Resident Evil Revelations, which I've heard this one was really good on the 3DS, definitely well worth picking up. Uh, over here you got some Yoshi's Theme Park, Wreck-It Ralph, which the movie is epic, I heard the games were okay. And you got the um, Bubble Cutties, I think that's what they're called. But anyways, let's go ahead and take on over to the next page over here we have some more Nintendo items over here they're selling a Nintendo Wii in a bundle which includes the Just Dance 4 limited edition or that's what the whole bundle is called it's called the Nintendo Wii Just Dance 4 limited edition bundle for $130 not a bad price and over here you can save uh, $10 on some other dancing games if that's all you're playing your Wii for you have the Just Dance Disney for $20 a pretty good deal and I actually did a walkthrough and review for this game and I gave it a 9 out of 10. Now it includes only 25 songs, just letting you know. Uh, it includes uh, some Disney classics, not a lot, unfortunately, which was probably the biggest letdown. But you, of course you have Hannah Montana, High School Music, and other Disney songs in there. But there are some Disney classics in here, so for $20, that's not really a bad deal, especially if you want to get it for yourself or for your kids. Really well worth picking up. So save $10. I think $20 is the perfect price for it. I wouldn't really personally pay any more than that. You have another dance game, Dance 2, Just Dance 4, and Hip Hop Experience. Some good games over there. Do you like workout games? Well, they have a bundle over here. You get both of these games, and you're going to be paying $50. Now, these games are normally $40 each, but you could get both for $50. That's a pretty good deal. So you're saving quite a few bucks there. You have the Dangerous Hunter for uh, minus $20, so you're getting this for $40. I haven't played any of the Dangerous Hunters games, so I'm not sure if they're any good or not. But right next to it on the right-hand side, they have Epic Mickey 2 for $40. And Epic Mickey 2 is a fantastic game. And what's cool about it, too, is that it's actually featuring two players. So that means one of you is playing as Mickey, and the other one is playing as Oswald the Lucky Rabbit, in this case, Mickey's brother. Really cool game, definitely well worth getting if you have a Nintendo Wii. Um, this deal also is going for the Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3 copies as well. You should definitely pick up Epic Mickey 2, one of the fantastic games that came out this year. Over here they have some deals on some Nintendo 3DS games. You can get the Angry Birds Trilogy for 20 bucks. Pretty good deal right there. They have Wipeout. They have some game over here. I have no clue what it's called because it's really hard to read. But they also have the Skylanders Giants for $65. And they got some other Skylanders accessories. These are like bobblehead pencils or pens. Oh, no, they're styluses. My bad. They're uh, bobblehead styluses. And there's also a carrying case to put all your Skylanders figurines. Pretty cool looking case. And you can get both and you'll be paying $25. So that's a pretty good deal right there. Now we get to the Nintendo Wii U, 
which is the new console in the Nintendo market. The Wii U is actually pretty cool. Now, I don't own one, but I really want to get my hands on one. So, unfortunately, the systems aren't going on sale at all because, you know, what can you expect? It just recently came out not that long ago. So, you have the 8 gig, which is the white version, and you have the 32 gigabyte, which is the deluxe set. Now, if you're going to be getting a Nintendo Wii U, I would highly recommend getting the $350 bundle. So, which means the deluxe edition. Why? Because there's a few different reasons. One, you're getting a couple extra accessories for it. You're getting a game and you're getting 32 gigs compared to 8 gigs. So you're getting more space. And from what I've heard too with all the updates so far on the Nintendo Wii U, especially on the 8 gig model, I've heard a lot of people are, are already running out of space on the 8 gig model. So definitely get the deluxe edition if you can find one. If not, if you only have the 8 gig, you could always upgrade it with uh, you know internal hard drives and stuff like that. You know, just giving you guys an idea. They have some other games over here, just basic prices. The only thing that's really going on over here is you can save $10 on these games, a couple sports games. You have Batman, the Armored Edition, and Mass Effect, which is pretty cool. Of course, they got some other good deals over here. Uh, just a couple over here. You know, the Zombie U's regular price, so it's the Just Dance 4. But they have this Sonic All-Stars Racing game over here, which includes a free Dyna car with purchase. Not a bad deal. I think it's, um, actually, I'm not sure where it is. I think it's like a Hot Wheel or something like that, but pretty cool. I mean, at least you're getting something free with your game. And another thing if, that you should definitely get if you own a Nintendo Wii U is this Wii U Nerf Armor Starter Kit. Now, I'm not sure what this pin thing looks like or, I mean, what it is or what it does, but they do have the armored casing, which is uh, this thick Nerf padding that goes around your Nintendo Wii pad. You should definitely get that, especially if you got the Nintendo Wii for your kids, or if you have kids within the area, or if you sometimes have butterfingers and drop it, it will protect the bottom side and absorbing some of the impact. It just won't protect if it lands on the screen and stuff like that. That's the only thing, though. For $20, it's not a bad deal, especially if you want to offer some pr extra protection for your product, especially after spending like $350 or you know, $200 or something like that. I mean, well worth getting it right there. So over on the next page, we have some PlayStation Vita stuff going on. So over here, they have a PlayStation Vita bundle going on. Now, if you remember during Black Friday, they had these bundles going for $200, which was a pretty sweet deal. So hopefully some of you guys grabbed some. If you missed out on that, don't worry. They have another good deal going on. So you got the PlayStation Vitas. You got the Assassin's Creed 3 bundle or the Call of Duty Black Ops 2 going for $250. The, basically, the deal that's going on for this one is that whatever one you choose, you get your choice of a free game, such as either Spy Hunter or Lego Batman 2. So I think that's a good deal. So you're, you're already getting a game with your bundle and a memory card, and you're also going to be getting another game for free. Pretty good deal. So you're getting two games for the price of one. Not bad. Um, over here on this um, red card over here, you get double in-store credit when you trade in your handheld systems towards a new PlayStation Vita system. It's a pretty good deal. So if you have the PlayStation Portable, which I'm not sure how many of you still have the PSP. I wish I still had mine. But you can always trade it in, get double and store credit, which I don't think you're really going to get much. So I don't think it's really worth it. But it would work with the other DS systems. So you're going to get double and store credit. But here's an awesome deal, especially if you have a PlayStation Vita and you want to get some games. These games right here are 50% off, which is the PlayStation All-Stars, which was released not that long ago, and Little Big Planet 2. So these are going for $20 instead of $40. Pretty sweet deal. Now, of course, with the Spy Hunter deal, they have Spy Hunter going separately for $20 if you just want to grab that by itself. They have this uh, carrying case for the PlayStation Vita. Pretty cool looking. They have a starter kit and a crystal clear case. So let's go ahead and check out the next page. Here's some other deals going on. So he, here's another nice one. Now let's say if you don't have Far Cry 3 or Assassin's Creed 3 and you really want to get both, they have a nice deal going on. If you purchase Far Cry 3, you're going to get $20 off of Assassin's Creed 3. Now this deal is going for the PlayStation 3, Xbox, and PC. So you know instead of paying $60 each, you're going to be paying $60 for Far Cry 3 and forty dollars for Assassin's Creed 3. So, pretty good deal right now. Uh, pretty good deal right there, especially if you really want to get both. 
Now's your chance. So you'd be spending probably a little bit over $100 because you got the tax to add and all that. Over here on the right hand side they have a PlayStation 3 bundle going on which consists of the PlayStation 3 Super Slim. So this one is $300. It includes the PlayStation 3 Super Slam, which is the 250 gigabyte version. It includes the Lego Batman 2 DC Super Heroes, Lego's Harry Potter Years 1 through 7, and Little Big Planet Karting. It's a pretty good deal. So you're getting a couple of Lego games and Little Big Planet Karting, and you're also getting a free month of the PlayStation Plus membership trial. Pretty good deal right there. And you can save $20 on these selected games over here. Some good ones to point out would be the Transformers Fall Cybertron, Spider-Man, XCOM, E for Speed, Hot, uh, Most Wanted, and a Medal of Honor Warfighter. Save $10 on these controllers. So instead of paying uh, $55, you'd be paying $45 for a PlayStation 3 DualShock 3 controller. $60 regular price, but like I said, they have All-Stars on the PlayStation Vita going for $20. So really well worth checking out. Save $10 on these games such as Sorcery, which is for the PlayStation 3 Move, um, the Zone of Endless, I think that's the name of it, and a NASCAR game. And over here, if you don't have Battlefield 3 yet, you should definitely pick one up, because especially since it's the Premium Edition, which includes Battlefield 3 and the Premium Membership, which means you get access to all the DLC that comes out for the game. The latest one was the Aftermath DLC, and I gotta say that is a pretty kick-ass DLC. I'm really enjoying that one. But definitely check out Battlefield 3 if you haven't done so already. So for $40, not bad. And its regular price is $60. They got $50 off on the PlayStation Move controller and charging station. So if you've been wanting to get a PlayStation Move or maybe some extra controllers, 50% off, not bad. You got a headset over here, normal price. Here's some other deals going on from Microsoft. So over here they have the 4 gig Xbox 360 Connect Holiday Bundle which consists of the Connect Adventures and Connect Disneyland. They have the Star Wars Limited Edition Connect or the Limited Edition Star Wars Connect Bundle which includes a pretty kick ass looking Star Wars console which is the you know the Xbox is looking like R2D2 and you got the controller which is C3PO and of course the you get the Star Wars game itself and along with the Connect. Uh, now the Connect game of it it's okay, not really anything too exciting, but if you want a kick-ass looking console, there you go. That one's going for $350. Save $30 right there. Now, if you've been wanting to get an Xbox Live Gold membership, in this case the year's worth, they have it over here at GameStop. You can save $15, which is going for $45 instead of $60. Another good deal. And over here, it's part of those... Um, it's that new thing Microsoft's doing where you can get an Xbox 360 for a really low price, but the only difference is you gotta have like some contract thing to where you pay, you know, whatever amount each month to basically pay off the Xbox. But over here it's a hundred dollars, which includes the Xbox 360 250 gigabytes, includes a digital download for Skyrim and a physical copy of the Forza Motorsport for a hundred dollars with a two-year Xbox Live Gold subscription. Nice deal right there, especially if you've been wanting to get an Xbox. They got the Kinect, $100. You can probably find one a bit cheaper on eBay or Craigslist. Over here, you can save $20 on these games. Medal of Honor, Sniper Elite, uh, Need for Speed. $10 off for like a bunch of sports games, Black Ops, uh, Family Guy. Uh, over here, they are doing something. If you've been wanting to get Call of Duty Black Ops 2, you get if you pick up Call of Duty Black Ops 2, you're getting a free poster with your purchase. And if you pick up Dance Central 3 on the Xbox 360 Connect, you're getting a bonus song called Call Me Maybe. You got some, you know, five dollars off selected strategy guides and some accessories going on. They have a headset for sale called the Triton uh, Detonator for only for the Xbox 360 on sale for fifty dollars. The normal price is seventy. They also have another one over here, which is the Turtle Beach Wireless Headset X42 going for $130, and the original price was $160. It's so pretty good deals over there. And last but not least, we have some uh, pre-owned deals going on. You know, GameStop loves trying to sell their pre-owned items. So let's go ahead and start with this bottom section over here. If you purchase any pre-owned console, whether it's the PSP, 
the 3DS, Wii U, which I doubt there'll be any Wii U's anyways right now. You know, just any pre-owned console, you're going to get a one-year free product replacement. So, which means if anything happens to your, you know, product, uh, you know, for it being used, GameStop will replace it absolutely free because, like I said, you're getting a full year's worth of product replacements. Pretty good deal right here. And, of course, they have another one over here. You get an extra 30% in-store credits. Uh, when you trade in any items towards a new copy of these selected titles like Epic Mickey, Dishonored, Borderlands 2, Halo 4, Hitman, uh, New Super Mario Bros. U, and pretty much so on. And the final page over here. And now I know a lot of people like to, you know, complain because GameStop rips you off or whatever. But, you know, people don't understand how to shop at GameStop. You got to, you know, when you trade in games at GameStop, you have to go when special promotional deals are going on. That's the time to go if you really want to get your money's worth with your trade-ins. I always shop at GameStop. It's my number one place to shop at. And I've never gotten ripped off with my trades. Just throwing that out there. But here's one of those awesome promotional deals, especially that I like to go for, which is a 50% extra in-store credit when you're trading your games towards any of these titles, which is basically a pre-owned product. Pretty good deal right there, especially not only that, if you're a rewards pro membership instead of 50 percent you're going to get 60 percent extra in-store credit really nice deal over there um, now in terms of consoles now this is where you want to be careful if you're really considering of trading in your console definitely i would not take it to gamestop because you're probably not going to get as much as you're expecting to be if you have to trade in a console i would recommend like putting it on ebay or craigslist or better yet do a console with a bundle deal going on and maybe start a bid at a certain area and work that way up but that's the only thing i would not recommend trading at gamestop is any consoles whatsoever because you're not really going to get a good deal out of it just letting you know try ebay craigslist or see if a friend or if your friend knows someone that wants to buy one and go for that just my word of advice and another thing they have you buy one get 50 percent off on old pre-owned all pre-owned electronics so if you happen to buy a pre-owned you know ipod touch you can get 50 percent off of another one Really nice one over there. And they also have a 30% extra in-store credit when you trade in any items towards the purchase of a new Nexus 7 32 gigabyte tablet. So I'm not sure if that's a good tablet or not. But anyways, that's the GameStop holiday guide that's going on. Like I said, that's from December 9th and will end on December 15th. If you guys have any questions or anything that you want me to go over with you in the comment section, just go ahead and leave that in the comments down below. Anyways, like I said, I'm Sir James from GamerFusion.com. And I hope you guys have a great holiday.